Hello students of my class first good morning to all let's continue with chapter 6 adding greater number and today we will learn adding two digit and one digit number open page number 106 in the earlier chapter we have learned addition till 20 number and in this chapter we will learn about 20 numbers okay students so this is our first example which is 25 plus 2 so this is very big number how can we add this number so today we will learn rules of addition and we already know every number made up of tens and ones so we can break every number two digit number in tens and ones how can we do that so here i have number 12 okay students and tens and ones we know this 25 have their place values so what is the place value of number 1 to 12 the one place value is tens and the two place value is ones so the number 1 will go to the tens place value and number 2 will go to the ones place value in the number 25 the 2 will go to the ten, tens place value and the 5 will go to the ones place value so in two digit of the number the digit coming first will go to the tens place value and the digit coming last will go to the ones place value so in the example of 5858 the number 5 go to the tens place value and the number will go to the number 8 ones place value because the number 5 coming first will go to the tens place value and the digit coming last will go to the ones place value so why we suddenly discussing about the tens in ones place value i'll tell you in addition we need to place the numbers as per their place value so in this example we have 25 plus 2 so how can we add this number 25 plus 2 yes so first we need to arrange these number in as per their place value so we write the tens and ones here so in the number of 2525 2 coming first so 2 will go to the tens place room and the 5 coming at the last number so the 5 go to, will go to the ones place value and here we have only 2 so the place value of 2 is 1 so we will write this 2 in the ones place value now what to do this is the first rule of addition we have to place the numbers as per their place values and then second add the digits the one place value and the tens place value separately and place them in below place ye jo ones place value ke number hai wo separately add honge aur ye tens place value ke number hai wo separately add honge aur ones place value ka answer ones place value mein jayega aur tens place value ka answer tens place value mein jayega in the second rule of the addition is i need to add the digit in the ones place value sabse pehle hum ones place value ke digits add karenge So I have five, so one, two, three, four, and five. And second, I have two, one and two. So how many fingers we have? We have five, six, and seven. So five plus two is seven. And the second, we will add the tens place value. And in the second. tens place value we can see there are there is 2 and here we have nothing so we will add 2 plus 0 it means 
2. So 25 plus 2 gives us 27 and 27 is our sum of 25 plus 2. The second example is 50 plus 5. First we need to arrange these numbers as per their place value. So the number comes first will go to the tens place value and the number come last will go to the ones place value which is 0 and this is the place value is 1. So we will write this 5 in the ones place value. Now the second rule is we need to add the ones place value first then we will add the tens place value. Both numbers we will add them separately. Hum dono in number ko separately add karenge. So 0 plus 5. So 0, 0 it means nothing. Plus 5. So how many fingers we have? We have 5 fingers. So we will write the 5 in the ones place value. Since I am adding the digits of one place value. So I only write the answer in the ones place value. Now we will move to the tens place value which is 5. We have only 5 here. So 5 plus 0 gives us 5. So the sum of 50 plus 5 gives us 55. Okay students. So the first rule is placing the numbers as per their place values. Then start your addition with ones place value. Then move to the tens place value. This is the rule of the addition. Our next example is 71 plus 4. So the first rule is place the number as per their place values. So the number comes first will go to the tens place room. So I write 7 in the tens place room. The number come at the last digit and the number will go to the ones place room. So I write the 1 in the ones place room. Here I have 4. So the place value of this 4 is 1. So we will 4 ko ones place value ki line mein likhenge. Now we will add this number. Now we will add this number. The second rule is add the ones digits first. And I have 1 plus 4. So 1 and we need to raise 4 fingers more. 1, 2, 3 and 4. So how many fingers do I have? 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. It means 1 plus 4 is 5. And in the tens place room, the third rule is add the tens place value after adding the ones place value. We have only 7 here and 7 plus 0 is 7. It means the 71 plus 4 gives us 75 of the sum and 75 is my sum. Our next example is 67 plus 2. So first we will arrange these numbers as per their place values. The 6 place value is 10. So I write this 6 in the 10th place value. The 7th place value is 1. So I write this 7 in the 1's place value. The next number is 2 and the 2 place value is 1. So I write this 2 in the 1's place value. Now I will add these number and the second rule is add the 1's place value numbers first. So I have 7 plus 2. So 5, 6 and 7. I have 7 fingers. Now I need to add 2 more fingers. 1 and 2. It means how many fingers we have? Let's count. 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. I have 9 fingers. It means 9 number. Since I am adding the digits of 1's place value. So I only write the answer in the 1's place value. Now the third rule is. Add the tens place value numbers. So I have only 6. So 6 plus 0 gives us 6. So the 67 plus 2 gives me the sum of 69. The 69 is my sum. The next one is 30 plus 40. So first arrange this number. 
the three comes first will go to the tens place room the zero comes at the end so the zero will go to the ones place value in the second number we have two digit of number and in the two digit number the number come first will go to the tens place value and the number come last go to the ones place value now we will add these numbers and the second rule is start our addition with the ones place value so 0 plus 0 it means we have to add nothing hame yahan pe kuch bhi add nahi karna hai 0 plus 0 gives us 0 in the second we have 3 plus 4 it means 1 2 3 fingers then we need to add 4 more fingers 1 2 3 4 so how many fingers i have 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 fingers. So, 30 plus 40 gives me 70 and 70 is my sum. In the next example, 30 plus 60. So, place the numbers. 3 goes to the tens place value and 0 goes to the ones place value. In the second one again, 6 goes to the tens place value and 0 goes to the ones place value value here again the second rule is add the ones place value which is 0 plus 0 gives me 0 and 3 plus 6 equal to 90 so the sum of 60 plus 30 is 90 in the next example 81 plus 5 so 8 coming First digit will go to the tens place value and the one coming at the last digit to go to the ones place value. The 5 is a single digit. It means the place value of this number is ones. So I write this 5 in the ones place value. Now I have 1 plus 5. So 1 plus 5 is simply 6. Now the third rule is move to the tens place value and I have only 8. So, 8 plus 0 is 8. So, the sum of this number is 86. So, 81 plus 5 gives me 86. So, the rule of the addition is we just need to arrange these numbers as per their place values. Then start our addition with the ones place value. Then move to the tens place value. And write the answers as per their separate rooms. So in the exercise of 6a, do question first and second at your own. Do practice at your own. That's all for today. Stay home, stay safe. Thank you.